93 WIPC Mobile News. On the level, on the go. A cry for help with your Alexa flash briefing. I'm John Herrick. Hospitals are either at capacity or getting to capacity because of the coronavirus, so hospital workers are making a plea. Eric Berman reports. Seymour's Schneck Medical System says it's had to send patients elsewhere the last two days. Other hospitals agree with Schneck CEO Eric Fish that staffers who are able to come to work are exhausted. When you're making your decisions in your everyday life, thank you for your health care team who has been battling this pandemic every day for the past eight months months. We need to trust the science. Stop making this public health emergency a political issue. Beacon Health System in northern Indiana says it's averaging a death every day, which creates an emotional strain on caregivers. Beacon has started putting off elective procedures, so it has enough staff. Eric Berman, 93 WIBC Mobile News. The Indiana Department of Health is planning on hiring 600 more contact tracers, which would bring the total to about 1,600 contact tracers, identify people who have tested positive for coronavirus, and they trying to determine where an outbreak may have started. State Health Commissioner Chris Box says the tracers have been overwhelmed by the case numbers. She's also recommending college students who are coming home from college and don't test positive for the virus to be contact tracers if they can help out. Avon High School Avon High School is transitioning to e-learning beginning today. The administration with Avon Community Schools says they're experiencing a high number of students and staff in quarantine. 